Why has John Cena posted a picture of Virat Kohli? I will tell you. Uske baad dekhenge. What does Suresh Raina have to say about Greg Chappell? Or sabse ant mein we're going to find out who is that Indian cricketer who has taken a social media detox after getting snubbed from the Sri Lanka tour. Hello everybody, welcome to Crick Chacker. My name is Nivedna Prabhu. I hope you're doing well and keeping safe. Before I begin this video, if you haven't liked, shared and subscribed to Crick Chacker as yet, don't wait for anything and hit that button quickly. So every time we come back with a new video, you know immediately. And Without wasting time, let's begin this video to find out what's making news in the world of cricket. This is not the first time somebody has praised Indian skipper Virat Kohli. Many famous personalities across the world have always spoken about how they really love Virat Kohli as a cricketer and of course just in terms of uh, you know the personality that he has on the field and even just in general about the kind of aura that uh, Virat Kohli carries. But the latest to be joining this bandwagon in a very different way is uh, WWE superstar John Cena. Now John Cena posted a picture of Virat Kohli and in typical John Cena fashion of making social media content he he did not put any caption to it which of course meant that the you know comment section was flooded with comments wondering as to why john cena has actually posted this but many of them were actually surprised or probably you know thinking that it could be because of the fact that india is ready to take on new zealand in the world test championship final and this is probably john cena's way of supporting the indian skipper going ahead into this competition now let me tell you one more thing this is not the first time that uh, cena has shared kohli's picture ahead of the india versus new zealand semi final clash in the 2019 World Cup, Cena also shared one of Kohli's pictures. Now, it looks like that connect is pretty strong, but you let me know in the comment section below. Why do you think Cena just randomly shared this picture of Virat Kohli? And do you also think that this is a way of him uh, supporting Kohli and of course Team India right ahead of the World Test Championship final? Comment below and give me your thoughts. One episode from the cricketing history definitely has to be the fallout between Saurav Ganguly and of course Greg Chappell as well. But in the latest book that Suresh Raina has written which is called Believe What Life and Cricket Has Taught Me, he has really jotted down, you know, gone down memory lane and spoken about how, um, you know, Greg uh, Chappell's tenure was during, uh, you know, that period when he was of course the coach of uh, Team India. Now, uh, contrary to what all the speculations were or even those episodes that happened with Saurav Ganguly, Suresh Raina has gone on to say, that actually Greg had nothing but good intentions for Team India. However, he also agrees that Greg could have treated the senior players back then in the Indian team way better. Now, what did Suresh really say? Well, I will tell you. Now, Suresh said, In my eyes, Greg was never wrong since he always strived to make sure the team was on its toes and never favoured any one player. Greg was ruthless when we lost, but most of it was directed towards the senior players. I do agree that he should have respected them more People like Sachin and Dada, of course, he's referring to uh, Saurav Ganguly. So, what do you all think about this particular statement that Suresh Raina has made? You know, considering the fact that he's saying that, uh, you know, Greg actually just wanted the best for Team India. And of course, the statement is coming out now. But how do you all look at it, especially because that fallout between Saurav Ganguly and Greg Chappell has, you know, become one of those really big moments in, uh, you know, Indian uh, cricketing history or just in general when cricketers and coaches have had fallouts. So, you let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Well, everybody is of course gearing up for the World Test Championship final where Team India will be taking on New Zealand. But after that, of course, before you know it, India will be taking on, you know, Sri Lanka in that other tour where another team, of course, is going to be going and playing this tournament. But in all this, you know, big high profile tournaments that happen, one thing that definitely happens when the squads are announced is, of course, you know, really discussion about, uh, you know, why this player was picked or why this player was rather not picked. And in that context, one player who's definitely been having that kind of uh, you know news going around has to be Jaidev Unadkar and right after the Sri Lanka uh, tours uh, squad was announced Jaidev announced on social media that he would be taking you know a break from social media but most importantly he also wants to focus on his game a lot more and lesser on the noise what did Jaidev say in that post well I will tell you a bit of that post says at this point in my career with all the useful experience that I've fortunately gathered I'm only going to appreciate what comes my way and keep fighting till the very end and that's not going to be soul Shaw. Maybe that could be taken as being soft, but then I'll keep the ruthlessness and aggression for when I'm out there on the field. I'm super grateful for your good wishes and support. Time to focus more on my game and work even harder. Until then, social media detox on. So, of course, you know, he's shared a really long... Um, 
social media posts this was a part of it he also went on to of course speak about uh, you know how he has looked at the game of the years how he's really learned and how he's matured and you know decisions of course uh, you know and kind of the journey that he's had as a cricketer has probably you know had a lot of thinking to do right now with the way things are happening with him currently but you guys tell me in the comment section below what do you think about Jaydev not being included in the Sri Lanka uh, squad for of course the upcoming tour and most importantly um, what do you also think of his post the way he saying that he would like to take a break and of course focus more on his game i really want to know your thoughts so tell me that in the comment section below well that's all i have for you in this edition of the news tracker if you like the video give it a big thumbs up follow all our social media channels including our telegram channel which has some amazing match winning combos as well as fantasy tips so if you like making your fantasy tips you know where to head now my name is nivedna prabhu i'll be seeing you very soon but until i see you next time if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet i don't know what you're waiting for so hit that button quickly and i will see you next time and we'll discuss everything about the world of cricket. See you and take care.